Are you guys ready to have some fun? No shit. Whoa! Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die on Alpha 21. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to go out and do another infestation quest and then a normal uh, tier two quest after we do the infestation, assuming we have time. Uh, before we get started, though, a couple of things here. Um, let's see, we're going to. Uh, we found this steel, make steel arrows magazine. And so, what we're going to do is guess what? Make steel arrows. So, let's go ahead and we can make a total of 40 of those because I have the arrowheads. I could um, make more arrowheads hold on a second arrow steel arrow ammo steel arrowhead um so yeah i can't make the arrowheads themselves with until we find a crucible but you know i find the steel arrowheads and loot and i can even buy them or even buy the arrow straight up uh from the traders um excuse me so uh we'll we'll go ahead and make this first 40 i'll probably keep the the iron ones as well just to, uh, you know, for normal Zeke's, and then if we have something a little stronger, we'll switch to the steel. Um, I think I'll do that anyways. That's going to take another slot, but, you know, it, it is what it is. We'll, we'll deal with it. We will deal with it. So um, as soon as these are done, they're done. Guess what? Look at that. They're finished. Okay, um, so let's see. We're going to run over and what time is it? It's 4.43. I'm going to sell um, this and this to the trader because we now have in our weapons and tools, we have a yellow iron pickaxe, uh, pickaxe rather, a yellow fire axe and a blue shovel, iron shovel that we found in some loot. And I put the, the tier one shovel here in the, uh, uh, the forge. And then I, also, as you can see, I made a, bu a bunch of cement up in the forge too in preparation for um, when we do actually get a cement mixer. All right, let's see. We are in pretty darn good shape on food and water. I've got bacon and eggs and uh, mineral water in my inventory. Oh, I also made a couple changes here. Um, I cleared this spot for the Kim bench uh, because we're going to go buy that Kim bench after we do the uh, infestation quest. And if it doesn't fit here, because the old Kim bench used to be you used to have to have like three blocks high so if it doesn't fit here then what i'll do is i'll move the storage box in well the storage box in particular and maybe this chest which i i set up to put like farming stuff in and, and just kind of miscellaneous stuff because we were running out of room in here i'll move this stuff over here so we can put the kim bench over here because it is a three block high spot but i'm not sure maybe the new kim bench is not that high we'll just have to see how things go all right let's head on over to this next infestation quest, uh, this sucker's like 1.5 clicks away, so it's going to be a little bit of time to get there. I'll meet you guys over there, and let's do it. All right, this brought us to a whole new town. He did. Uh, a whole new town here. So this is our normal town, and this is a new town. And... Um, I think, well, actually, I guess I don't know for sure, but um, we should look to see if there is another trader in this town, because it would be nice to have uh, three traders to to work from. I'm just trying to look and see what Trader Q and Trader Jin looks like, you know, from the bird's eye view here, but uh, we'll probably have to... We probably have to drive around uh, or ride around a little bit on the bike to uh, figure that out. Who's coming? Where are you? Oh, he's on the other side of that wall. All right, let's loot this car. And um, I think we've already done this POI, but we haven't done it in infested mode. Let's deal with Edgar here. All right. Oh, look at him juke like that. Okay. Um. All right. Let's uh. Let's go ahead and just start this quest here. 
Whatever happens in this episode, I really want to have that Kim bench by the end of the day for sure. Um, so whatever we do, we gotta we gotta make sure that happens. All right, so we got Spider Monkey here. He dead. We got Steve the Running Feral here. He dead. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do a thorough looting, just real basic looting, because again, I just want to make sure we can accomplish everything that I want to accomplish today. So. That's feral, big mama. All right, you pissed me off. Enough of that business. Let's take one of these. I, I do want to check cabinets because we have chance for magazines in cabinets, uh, case in point. Sham chowder, nice. Fan frickin' tastic. We're really Oh, look at that. We're in tier four now, you guys. We're really doing good on the food. Um and you know, I've only put one point into Master Chef, too, by the way. Um, but we're already into tier four. So the only thing left to unlock is the really, really high end stuff. Uh, so shepherd's pie, spaghetti, and gumbo, and then, you know, the grandpa's elixir and grandpa's uh, moonshine stuff. So, yeah, I'm pretty pleased with how we're progressing when it comes to food. For sure. There's another one. Okay. That's chicken. We'll eat it right now. Let's see, did I reload this sucker? I did. This is loaded. That's loaded. That's loaded. And that's loaded. Okay, we're good. We'll check this because it's behind here. You know what? I'm not going to do that. Okay, we got a closet, a closed door, a closed door. Let's go in this room first. Get out of here. Oh shit, did I close the door on myself? Alright. I did. <laughs> I closed the door myself. Yeah, we'll take that, I guess. Uh, nope. Don't give a shit about that. Mm, let's grab these. Guess we can get some more plastic. Um, that plastic's no longer there. All right, let's quit wasting time on plastic. We gotta go. We gotta move it. Move it. We gotta groove it. Groove it. Nice. See another red dot? Somebody around the corner there, most likely. Or in the cabinet. And he's dead. Get rid of that. Take the rest of that stuff. Take our arrow. Nice. Okay. I think we're finished in this room. You're feral. You're not. And you're dead. Shit. We probably better take a big one now. I'm going to need to put a point into, uh, oh, you know, the one that uh, makes bandages more effective. I don't remember what it's called, but that one. Coming from down below? Hmm. I don't know. Let's just do that so we don't got to worry about anybody from down below.
Yeah, this is the room that has that weapons bag up there. Some blueberries. Explosives, temper blade mod, and some other stuff. Um, can I? Uh, well, no, I can't because I don't have enough slots. What does this currently have on it? Uh, no, not that. This. Yeah, we we're still not running into radiators yet. So let's put this blade on here, and we'll just hang on to that. This will probably attach to something and sell it. Maybe we'll see. Um, let's see. Get rid of that. You know what? I, I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed with that. We're we're gonna toss that too. These can be scrapped. Actually, let's make sure our pipe weapons are first fully repaired, which it looks like they are, so we'll scrap these. Don't care about that. We can eat the pears now. Don't care about tin coal. Honestly, I don't really care about the cloth either because we have almost two full stacks of cloth back at the base. Okay, there we go. What in the heck? Get up the stairs, man. All right, I see yellow dots there. I'm sure that's going to probably represent more than one Zombo, probably multiples. Uh, we do have Molotovs on us, so, you know, there is that. If we can... Open the door... <laughs> Are you guys ready to have some fun? No oh, shit. Whoa! <laughs> oh man, I got stuck. I couldn't get off the stairs. Oh, boy. Well, I think we killed most of them, if not all of them. <laughs> Son of a bitch. That's like our third death of this whole series. Wow. I couldn't, yeah, I got stuck in the little stairwell thing. I couldn't jump back off. <sighs> you know what? That, uh... Oh, look at that. We actually, we actually completed the quest. So we did kill them all. Oh, that was fortunate. That was very, very fortunate, ladies and gentlemen. Who put those there? Oh, I guess I did. <laughs> I can't believe that. Yeah, so we uh, we did manage to kill them all. They killed us too. What? Damn it. Uh, they killed us too, but we... Wait, wait, where's my backpack? Uh, Houston? What the hell? It's okay. <laughs> Can't explain that one. Son of a bitch, man. All right. Yep. Yeah, that's uh, death number three of the series. The second death was during that um, gathering montage where my I, I was trying to kill a, a vulture that was attacking me. And every time I thrust my spear, he would go up when I would go down and he would go down when I would go up. And it, it, oh, it was just it pissed me off so bad. But it is what it is. It happens, right? Uh, okay, so wiring bows and rifles. Very good. We'll take that. And then we should be clear to get the fat loots because we have cleared this this place. Okay, we got some of those. Got another one of these. Where is... Oh, it's right here. Another food thingy. We'll eat the Mao Chow now because it's not using any recipes. And check the normal fat loots. We'll check the working stiff. Now the Forge Ahead magazine. That's what we need, man. We got to get that cement mixer before Horde Night 28. And a nice little supply of ammunition. We'll take it. We will take it. 
A 10,000 hit points? Are you shitting me? Uh, we got to get out from this side. Uh, we'll take those and those. All right. So, yeah, that was quite unfortunate, but it happened. And all we can do is piss and moan about it a little bit, but just move on. So let's just move on. We can't expect to not die at all on these settings. Um, and that's generally why I don't do... Did we check this again? We did. I don't do Insane Nightmare um, permadeath series anymore because they... It's just you work so damn hard, you know, to advance, and then something like this happens and you die and you got to start all over. And it's just plain not fun, man. That's all I'm going to say about it. Uh, let's see. What time of day is it? It's only 9 in the morning. I'm going to tell you what. I'm going to ride around a little bit in this town and see if we can find another trader before we actually head back for our turn in. Okay, looks like we found a trader here. It's a uh, wrecked. Trader wrecked. Okay. Whoop. All right, let's do a quick loot of Trader Rex place. Um, no, actually, no to all of that stuff. Well, you know what? Let's actually take that in case uh, we can end up selling it to him. Destroyed workbench. Nice. Duct tape. We'll take it. Oh, I was hoping one of those would be in there. Okay, we'll take all that stuff there. Um, can we do anything with these little tanks here? I don't think so. <clears throat> uh, we can't harvest the corn plants. We can harvest this, though. Or loot it, I guess I should say. This is a destroyed chem bench. No, we're not taking that. That's all concrete, but we can't loot it. Can't break it. Anything in here? Does not appear to be anything in there. Take some glue. Nice. Okay, so now we're up to the anvil. <clears throat> So we have, um, we need five more magazines to get to, to the next tier. And I think that, um, let's look at that again. Workstations. I think that, yeah, that'll probably unlock the cement mixer at that point. So let's hope we can do that before the Horde Night. We should be able to. I don't see why not. Unless we have some really, really bad luck between now and then. This is Rex's little cabin. We're going to eat his food and read his magazines. Uh, chicken soup. Mm, I don't, is, wait, is that used in a recipe? It's not. Okay. Let's just eat it now because we really are encumbered big time here. Oh, these are like cabin rentals. Interesting. Uh, we have cloth, right? I think so. Let's grab that. And that's it. We've hmm. doesn't seem like he has as much stuff to loot as some as the other traders did. We can't loot that vehicle or that vehicle. Why does it not surprise me that Trader Rect is stingy? A stingy dude. Look at all these pallets of feed and stuff. That's really that's not lootable? It's not giving me any option to loot it. Oh, man. What the heck, dude? What about these? Nope. I guess they're not. Sounds like we got a wandering horde that came on through. Can we loot his cast Put register? Put away your weapon unless you'd like to die in my store. All right, here. Let's see your inventory. We're going to sell you some of this. Some of that. All of those. Some of that, this, this, and that, and this. Uh, we'll sell brass, we'll sell iron. I'm gonna chuck that stuff. You want these feathers? He does, look at that. We're gonna sell this and that. <clears throat> um, 
Oh, damn, he bought all of those. <laughs> I didn't think he would buy all of them. Okay, well, that's okay. We can easily make more of those. You want some paper? Nope, not enough. All right, I'm going to chuck this, chuck this. Let's uh, make sure that this is Cha -ching! Thanks, buddy. repaired. And then we're going to throw that out. Do uh, you want some... Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to throw those out, too. Okay. Um, do you want some beer? Yep, he'll take the beer. Do you want this? Uh, I know I could put that on the club, but I'm just going to sell it straight up just to free up some space. So we're up to 1700 and change on coin. Uh, all right, let's take a look at his inventory. I think he's the farming guy, isn't he? Like the food and farming guy? Uh, if he has any... It doesn't look like he has any... What's this? Target's full health. Yeah, we're going to buy that. Uh, he doesn't have any workstation uh, or forge ahead magazines, which kind of sucks, but whatever. Shotgun, da, 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 da. Serrated blade. Nerdy. He's got nerdy glasses. How much does he want for those? 3,000? Okay. And that's the stuff I sold to him. So he doesn't have any shotguns. None of these traders have any shotguns. That's very interesting. Um, okay, so. A sale is a sale. Even, even if it's, it's a, a scumbag like, like you. you. Um, uh, Watch don't... yourself, stranger. I know some fellers who break legs for coin. Just wonder if we want to take a, take jobs from him now, too. I mean, ultimately, we probably do want to do that. So if we took something to the southwest, um, or at least to the west... Two ninety-five. I'm gonna make you an offer. You, you better right. not fuck this up. That's hey, language, Mister. We'll probably um. I might do that one off camera because we've already done Williams' residence. We'll have to see. All right, guys, let's head on back, do our infested turn-in, and then we are gonna buy ourselves a he's marked on the map now right yeah trade direct the game automatically marks the traders for you now uh we're gonna buy ourselves a kimpage looking forward to it i'll see you guys back at our our town when we do our turn in Hi, Hugh. Something you want to buy? Well, okay. I lost the bet on this one. Here's some money. Think we're going to take the forged steel. This would be nice, though. Um, boy, that would be nice. But, well, I'm sure we'll come across this again. Uh, so, yeah, let's take the forged steel this time. Actually, it would be nice to make this, too, but the only weapon we really need that on is our spear, and we already have one. So, yeah, let's take the steel. Okay. You have another infested clear 1.2 clicks to the north, and that's a new yeah. thing. So, okay, we'll take that. We've got a deal. All right. Now, for you, my dude, um, we're going to... I guess I don't really have anything to sell to him. I found... Shotgun parts and the potato in a uh, duffel bag on the way over here. Uh, so, yeah, let's go ahead and purchase the chemistry station for 15,000 coin. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. Do the math. Yeah, we did the math, and it was expensive as hell, but we bought it anyways. Um, target's full health take 20% damage. Okay, nice. All right, so let's head on back to the base and set ourselves up a chemistry station. If that, if that um, quest that he gave us was not so damn far away, I'd do it now, but I don't think we have time. So let's go set up our chem bench and then, yeah, we'll go set up the chem bench and then we'll see where we're at from there. 
Okay, so it will let us put the bench there. But uh, we'd have a little bit of trouble getting to our storage back behind. Um, so it's it's only two high now, but it's still three wide. So, how do we want to do this? We could put it... it, it come on. It, it doesn't go... Yeah, I want you to go there. Nope, it doesn't want to go there. Oh, now it will. Why wouldn't it go right... <laughs> right here? I want it to go right... I don't get it. Uh, maybe it has something to do with this roof piece. Hmm. Well, all right. Why don't we do... What I had said we would do if, if this didn't work. Um... The only problem with that, it's not a major problem, but we're going to have to, we, we can't, for whatever reason, God only knows, and the fun pimps, is they don't let us pick these boxes up. Um, I don't know why. So we're going to have to rebuild that box. So we'll put this box here in this corner, and we'll put the campfire here. Okay. And then, let's see, we're going to need... Uh, ten nails. Look at that. We have ten nails. How about that? And let's go uh, writable storage box. I didn't have. I don't think I had another one of those, did I? If I did, I probably would have put it in there. Yeah, I don't know why the heck they don't let us pick these up. Okay, and then we will call this. Food and meds. Oh, for goodness sakes. Caps lock. So, even if the box is empty, see, there's still no option to pick it up. So, in case you were wondering if I emptied it out first, no, that doesn't work. Alright, so let's pull everything out of here and put it all into here. And then we'll have to destroy this. All right, now we should be able to take this and stick it right there. Look at that. Uh, this is kind of in the way. That's not even serving any purpose other than a little bit of decoration, maybe. Uh, here, we'll just put it right there. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we have our own Kim bench. It's a beautiful thing. Uh, we still need to get the recipe to make gas, though. And that's going to become a thing very quickly when we start thinking about, you know, uh, motor vehicles and power tools and that sort of thing. But the good thing about vanilla, unlike a lot of the mods I've played recently, is, you know, we can get a decent amount of gas just by wrenching cars. So even though I can go to the desert and mine oil shale it doesn't do me any good until i can actually make gasoline so that's probably let's look at this if we go to here and here and we go to vehicles yeah see we got oh shit we got to get all the way to 20 in vehicles before we can make gasoline but you know what i mean we're at 13 already um so we're not that far away from that and we could even put a point, you know, into... Uh, we have, oh, shoot, we have two points. Okay, let's... Let me think about this for a second. We... If we put... In order to put the third point into engineering, that will really get us going on the... Uh, on the workstations... We would need to first get intellect up to six. And 
we can do that right now. I think we're going to do that, guys, only because here again it is very important. I think it's very, very important that we get a cement mixer by Horde Knight. And so by putting the point into here, we will... Um, uh, we'll just increase the chances of that happening. Plus, all the, you know, we'll get the other perks from it too. So, if we go back to here now and we go to workstations, um, yeah, we just sent, we just need to come up with five more magazines. So, since we put, well, we can't put another point in there until we level again, but we're already, you know, eighty percent of the way there. That just increases the chances of us finding even more Forge Ahead magazines, which will, um, you know, get us to the cement mixer. Now, we obviously don't need to grind to the chemistry station now, but we do need the crucible. I'm hoping and praying that we'll be able to find this in some loot or from a trader before we have to grind all the way to 75 to get that. Man, they really made that hard to get, didn't they? Goodness gracious. Uh, but, you know, we'll see how things play out. We always, you know, the good thing is that the traders are giving us 25 steel as, as potential quest rewards. Um, and... Yeah, so that's, I mean, that's making a huge difference in and of itself. But the thing is, we still can't make steel items like arrowheads without a crucible. Um, but, you know, like I said, we might be able to keep going with that stuff just through looting and through trader rewards and stuff like that. Okay, guys, um, I think we're out of time in this episode. So what I'm going to do, what time is it? It's 1536. Um, let me see something here. This, that's too far away. This is really close. You know what? Let's just go. Let's just go knock this out really quick. This might be a little bit longer episode, but most of you guys don't usually mind if they're a little bit longer. Um, so let's take one of those, and then when I come back uh, overnight, I'll start, you know, making gun. You know, well, actually, I probably I need to get more coal and nitrate first. Let's see. We want to go. Uh, it's this one here, so make that the active quest. Okay, so we're going this way. Yeah, let's just bust this one out real quick. Shouldn't take us too long. Famous last words, though. This is a new POI. We have not done it yet. So tier two, but it's not an infested, so it shouldn't be that difficult. Why are all the pawns in this place called Paul's Pay Lake? I don't know. I don't get it. There's a pig after us. Ow! You bastard! <laughs> he gave us a freaking uh, a concussion. And, oh, son of a bitch! He gave us a concussion and a wrong weapon and a sprain and an abrasion. Wow, these guys are bastards. Huh. <sighs> okay. Better give us a shit ton of bacon for that after all that. Rifle magazine. Uh, we can now make pipe rifle quality five. Are there any other uh, crops in these fields besides corn? And my guy is just going to have to piss and moan about his sprain. I don't have time to deal with it. So he's just going to have to hurt. I'll fix it later with a steroid or whatever. I don't have a steroid on me, do I? Oh, I do. Never mind. We're good. That was fortuitous. All right. So, hey, look at that. There's an ammo pile in the field. All I see over here, anyways, is corn. Uh, I see corn in a combine. And Ronald McDonald. But it doesn't appear that there are other types of crops. What is this? This is a Claire Andrew tree. Okay, so let's just do this. Aren't there going to be zombies that are going to jump down? Yeah, I figured there would be. Come on, boys. Come on off the roof. It's just you? Anything to loot in here? Yeah, we got a duffel bag or a backpack, rather. Uh, okay, yeah, we'll take that. In fact, we will take... Oh, man, I guess I didn't put all my meds back, and it's a damn good thing I didn't either, huh? Uh, let's take this for the abrasion. 
There we go. Okay. It's almost as if I planned it that way, but I didn't. Let's check this vehicle here. All right. Not really too concerned with the chicken. Let's start the quest. Nice. All right, where did that damn pig come from? He, oh, he's right there. Uh, okay, so let's check this vehicle again. Sure, why not? Satchel's on this floor. Sneaking over trash makes no sound. I like that one. Look at all the wood in here. You know what? We, we're in bad shape, actually. Um, yeah, let's take another one of these for the abrasion. It didn't do any good. Frick. Frick a stick. All right, we're just going to have to be super careful. Something I'm really good at, as you guys know, not. <laughs> Nurse Nancy, you scared me. Oh. There's meds on the toilet. Nice. Okay, let's go in here. More food. We're going to chuck those. Why are we... Wait a second. It's not nighttime yet. Why are we completely unencumbered? Oh, steroid. Yeah, duh. <laughs> That's good. What the heck, man? Steroid. Hello. All right. I'm going to chuck that for now. I know I've been starting to get that, but uh, we'll sell that and that. Um, We need to be a little bit judicious about our inventory. What the? Oh, I feel like something jank's going on in here. That door's locked. Okay. So we already came through here. Okay, let's go upstairs. Hmm. Yeah, let's go this way first. A couple of bookshelves. More food. Man, we're going to be maxed out on food in no time. Take that for selling. Another bathroom. Okay, let's go this way. Oh, lumberjack. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> the new sound is hilarious. Stand up. He's bleeding. Got him. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll sell those. Do, do, do. Yes, I know I'm leaving some radiators behind, but again, we're kind of in a hurry here. Uh, nice. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? I left the, uh, I left the satchel downstairs. Let's run back down and grab that real quick. It is right in here. Yeah. Um, underneath here. Oh, there it is. Hmm. Usually plays like a little thingy when you grab that, but it didn't this time. Not sure why. Okay, let's go up here. Whoops. No, it. Stop jumping. Oh shit. Too many, too many Zeekers all at the same time. We're done? We didn't have to go out to that barn? Wow, okay. Check the fat loots. Um, 7.62 ammunition. Wait, armor piercing, nice. Uh, we already have one of those, so we'll probably end up selling that. This is used in a recipe. That we'll keep because we don't have better leather leg armor. Grab all of those. Grab those. That barn across the way must be a different POI, I guess. I don't know. Check the popping pills. All right, let's see. We can do... Okay, we're going to need to do this. Let's um, repair this. And get rid of the paper. Repair. 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 Okay. Then, um, did that use, yeah, that used up all the iron. Okay. Let's see. Don't really want to throw anything else away. Uh, but what we can do is grab this now and turn this into one of these. Let's chuck that. Take those. Take this. Because we could use the health. Drink a couple of these. Maybe even three of those. Well, we probably didn't need three. Let's drink, or eat that. And we're good. Okay. Uh, sure, why not? We'll take those. Okay, so I think that's it. Want that and that. Here's a duffel bag. Uh, yes, definitely take that. That'll be worth some money. Or oh, we might even hang on to that. Uh, BDU top, nice. I don't think we have a BDU top. I don't want it to look red, though. Okay, we'll keep the hooded sweatshirt for cold weather operations. Uh, you know what we do need to do, though? Um, we need to do this. Do this. That and that. It's a beautiful thing. All right, let's go. Vamanos. How do we get into this place? Through the front door. So yeah, there is, this is, this has got to be part of the POI, but obviously it's not going to have the fat loots in it. Uh, got a Piggly Wiggly. All 
we gotta go. Um, we'll come back in and investigate this place some other time. I mean, we know, you know, we know there's no fat loots in here. There are other things that we could loot, of course. Like that. Oh, yeah, we want this glue for sure. Oh, shit. What are we going to get rid of now? Let's get rid of those. Super easy to make in the forge. I can't pass up glue, you guys. Um, those aren't a big deal. I just want to take a really quick look at what's here, just so we know, you know? Doesn't look like there's a whole lot up here but hay bales. There's something nasty here. Oh, shit. Yep, there is. All right. We'll take the plastic. Okay. I think that's it. Besides this. Uh, none of which we need. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go before it gets too late. Hi, Jen. Well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Yeah, now sore being the operative spend, word there. Um, a ten percent off sale for the rest of the day. Okay, man, these these rewards are so good that they're <laughs> it's hard to decide. A robotic sledge could come in handy. We don't need two antibiotics. We're doing good on that. We don't need an orange fire axe. I mean, the steel guys. The steel is just. I think that's what we need to take. Again, let's do it. And it looks like we're finished with tier two with Jin. Oh, wow, they give you a workbench? At the end of tier two, I had no idea that they did that. Interesting. Okay, well, we don't need a second workbench. I mean, we might at the very end game, but not right now. Uh, I'm saying maybe an AK-47 for, for a 47 bundle? Because we can make these. We don't need this. We don't. We can make those. Scrap armor bonus bundle. I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's take the AK-47 bundle. Special jobs. Opening trade routes. Hey, Trader Bob. Finally a new this trader. Dangerous okay. dangerous work, but I believe you can handle it. I think we can too. All right. Let's take a look at your inventory. Uh, we're going to sell you a couple things. We're going to sell you this. I'm going to start saving on to extra mods until we can put them on something. But we will sell you that. Uh, I think I have an extra helmet light I could put on that and to sell. Uh, take however much brass, take the coin. I can make gunpowder now. You know, actually, we, well, no. Blue is more precious because it takes water. You can take as many. No, she doesn't want any bones. You can have this. And you want some feathers? Yep, she wanted some feathers. Look at that. I hope you get feeling better. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's open this up. And it gives us a less valuable AK, but three assault rifle magazines. Okay. And now we can make pipe machine gun quality five. We got 71 more 7.62s. This we could hang on to until I can pop a mod on it. The thing is, though, is it seems to me, if I remember right, in Alpha 20, it wasn't worth a mod, putting a mod on something unless it was blue or higher. We should, we should test that because they might have changed it in Alpha 21. So I want to test that before I know for sure. If it's still the same, then that means basically anything that's green or below should just be sold straight up and not modded first because it isn't worth it. But uh, like I said, we'll, we'll check that out and see what the deal is. All right, guys, that is it for this episode. I am going to um, do what I can tonight in the Kim Bench, which may not be a whole lot, actually, uh, depending upon what the resources I have. And then um, tomorrow will be day 24. And I think we just we just want to keep doing these jobs. We want to do this infestation. And we'll start working on uh, anything that's a Tier 1 that we've already done. For these new traders, Erect and Bob in particular, I'm just going to do off camera. I might like to show you the end loot or something like that. But we've already done them um, more than once, actually. We've done it originally, and then we've probably done a speed run on those. So I'm just going to do those off camera, unless it's a new POI that we haven't done yet. In that case, I will show it on camera. And, um, and we'll go from there. So thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.